Well, it's Thursday and around here, we like to call it Baby Friday. We have a really great show lined up for you today and we started off big with the man who ate his way to fame and flavor. Over 1.4 million followers uh, follow Dame and he's got great reviews. He's taking his crispy style to Netflix and he's got a new series called Fresh, Fried and Crispy. Here's my chat with the man himself, Dame Drops. Take a look. Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness, the one and only Dame Drops. How are you? I'm, I'm feeling good this morning. I'm feeling great. How are you doing? I'm doing fine. I'm doing Excellent. fine. I got my sugar-free Red Bull. It's a Friday. Okay. I'm just ready to talk to you. All right, let's go. All right. Let, I just first want to start with you've gone from retail, then you started doing your car videos immediately loved by so many fans now you got your netflix show you gotta yes. be like this is so cool right now uh mind is blown my mind is blown you know i've been at this for 11 years mm -hmm. i'm gonna be at it for another 11 years right and at the end of the day it's just me being myself with food presenting it to a whole bunch of strangers people loving it and i'm loving the energy when i get out there and taking pictures with folks and and have an opportunity to dine with individuals as well as the years have progressed to the point that i have my own netflix series fresh fried and crispy dropping june 9th and we're about to go international now now, now we're not just no so much in that box we're going outside the box right it's about yeah. to be crazy. well you know what well deserved i mean it's so cool watching you, especially when you, I, I mean, you're so real and it, I always want to go grab whatever it is that you're eating. <laughs> <laughs> so it's just so cool to see you go on such a bigger platform. All right, let's talk about the show. It kicks yes. off June the 9th, fresh, fried, and crispy. Give us a little insight as to where you're going to be going and what you're excited about trying. Well, look at Claudia, you know, you're out there in Denver, so let me just properly show Denver some love. I found yeah. myself at Buckhorn Exchange, blew my mind when I walked in. You know, I, I've seen heads of animals once before <laughs> inside of a restaurant, just not that many. And the, the owner, she threw me a nice little curveball with the Rocky Mountain oysters. I wasn't ready for that. Nothing can prepare a man or woman for that situation, <laughs> but I handled it the best way I could. I can't wait for you guys to see that. Ended myself at uh, Biker Gyms, who is a okay. very eclectic individual when it comes to the food. You know, he, he doesn't he, he doesn't fear trying something new, whether it's alligator or rattlesnake, and taking that particular flavor, blending it into flavors we already know, and creating his own masterpiece with that when it comes to food. So I got excited just meeting Biker Jim. His energy was wild. It was crazy. So you guys are definitely going to love that. And uh, another spot that I went to that threw me off out there in Denver because I didn't see a body of water. I saw mountains. So to go to a yeah. seafood spot, which was Big Mac and Little Lou's, right? And mm -hmm. to have hogfish. Claude, you ever had hogfish before? I have not. Okay, let me tell you something. Tell me hogfish, about it. They, they, they tend to dine on like crabs and shrimp. And mm -hmm. it's a nice big layer of fish that comes out on you and it's so tender but it has so many flavors yeah i have had you know codfish before tilapia hogfish that that that's one of those dishes you have to keep running back for more and even really? when you finish it there at the restaurant you ask for another dish of it immediately you're like i don't know what that was it was amazing please bring me more hogfish. yeah Okay. I'm going to have to take you up on that one. <laughs> okay. I, I, I've seriously been curious to ask you this, but what are your top three fried foods? Like it's you on an island, no one else. You got three fried foods for the rest of your life. What are those? All right. So I'm definitely going to go whew, with my fried chicken. Have to have that, right? Oh, yeah. French fries. Oh, I, yeah. I really love French fries. I don't know why. I just, I honestly do. And at the end of the day, my, my fish has to be fried. So my fried chicken, my fish has to be <laughs> fried because it has to be tender. Like, here's the crazy part. When you have your fish fried the right way, even yeah. if you don't like the fried portion of it and you just kind of like skin it off, the fish is twice as tender as it normally is. Yeah. Like, you're like, when you bite it, you're like, hold on. Regular fish that came out not fried, and then my fish that came out fried, and you take a bite of that, well, okay, that just changed my life. Yeah. It changes the yeah. consistency of greatness that you're about to take a bite out of. 
Oh my goodness, that is good stuff right there. That's so true. Okay, favorite fries. I, I have to ask. <gasps> McDonald's fries. <laughs> McDonald's, that, that, that's easy. That, that, that's easy. And we all know at the end of the day when it comes to McDonald's fries, when you ask for them with no salt, they're really going to come out fresh. Put your own salt on there. Don't, don't worry about their salt. Because, yeah. like, you know, it's going to be like maybe 60 40 that you're going to actually catch some oh, yeah. good McDonald's fries salted up, not being cold. Just put your own salt on there. You'll thank me um, later. I'm going to do that too. I always like, I'm always watching what I eat. Not all the time. I've got my mm -hmm. moments, but my kids are all about McDonald's fries. I yeah. end up eating the McDonald's fries because they're so good. Oh my goodness. Well, we are looking forward to the show. Oh my God, Dame, such a pleasure to have some face-to-face -face time with you. We'll be Thank watching you and we are wishing you all the success in the world right here in Denver. Appreciate it. Thank you, Claudia. All right. Take care. We'll see ya. Oh, he's such a good time. Fresh, fried, and crispy is a new food and travel series starring Dame Drops. It premieres June 9th on Netflix. Be sure to check it out.